Hello friends, welcome back to Toddlers at Work. Today I have a very very interesting story to share with you all. And after this story, you all need to do an activity too. Doesn't it sound interesting? Yes. So, come let's see which story I have brought in for you. The title of today's story is Why Are Bubbles Round? And the author of this story is Sukanya Sinha and the illustrations are done by Swapnil Kapoor. Have you ever blown soap bubbles? And have you ever wondered why always the bubbles are round not any other shape? Come let's find it out with Manu and Maya who try to make different shape bubbles also. But what happened? The bubbles turned out still round. So let's figure out why bubbles are round. Twins Manu and Maya were on their way home from school. At the traffic signal, they saw a man selling bubble making kits. He dipped a plastic wand into a bottle, took it out and blew it into it. A stream of bubbles floated into the air. Some reflected rainbow colors. 10 rupees, 10 rupees, he cried out. The light turned green and the bus drove off. Ma, can we buy a bubble kit? said Manu as they had dinner that evening. Ma said, Oh, you can make one at home. Why don't you try it tomorrow? That night, Manu and Maya dreamt of bubbles. Next morning, Maya made shampoo with water in a small red bucket. She carried it to the garden. Manu found some pieces of wire in Baba's toolbox. He twisted the end of one piece so there was a small circle at one end. He dipped the wand into the soap water and blew it in the circle. He blew very hard and no bubbles came out. Blow it like this, said Maya and she blew gently. No bubbles came out. Manu tried again. Oh, they shouted as a stream of round bubbles floated in the air. And Pulfi chased them and barked. Woof, woof. I'm going to make a different bubble blower, said Maya. She twisted the end of a piece of wire into a square. I bet my bubbles will look like little boxes, she said. Let's make other shapes too, Manu said. Manu made star shapes and triangle shaped ones. He was eager to see bubbles of different shapes too. The twins watched Kulfi chasing the bubbles. All of them were round. How strange, isn't that? Ma, we tried to make bubbles of different shapes, but they're all round, complained Maya. Round is a special shape, said Sukhvinder auntie, their neighbor, who was chatting with their mother. She worked at the science museum in the city. So she explained, you know why bubbles are round? Because when we make bubbles, we blow air into the bubble skin and the bubble skin stretches least when it is round. If it is any other shape, the skin will have to stretch more to hold that much air. Bubbles do not like that, added Sukhvinder auntie. Bubbles are lazy, they don't like stretching, Manu shouted. And he ran off to blow more bubbles with Maya. So they had wonderful time blowing soap bubbles. Would you like to blow bubbles? So then you have to do an activity at home. Come, let's listen what exactly you need to do to blow some soap bubbles at home. You have to squeeze some liquid soap or shampoo into a cup and then add some water to make a soapy solution. And you have to make sure it does not become very watery and add the water in very, very small quantities. And then ask your mama, papa to give you a piece of wire and you try to twist them in different shapes. You can make a circle, a triangle, a square, a rectangle, a star, whichever shape you want. Then dip those frames into the soap solution. Hold it up and notice that how the soap film will cling to the frame, forming a square or a circle or a triangle according to the shape of the frame you've made. Then try blowing gently on the soap film to make bubbles like when the bubble leaves the frame, what will you see? They may start as different shapes, but they will 
always form round bubbles and then you can do one more activity would you want to try you can take a dab of paint from your paint box and you can mix it with the bubble solution and then try blow bubbles and notice which color are they what you will notice is that your bubbles will not come out in a different color because the paint is heavier and it gets pulled down by gravity and collects in a little blob at the bottom of the bubble so if you think you can add color to the soap mixture or the bubble solution and you can make your bubbles colored try doing that it doesn't work on earth whereas it so happened that one seven year daughter of a japanese astronaut asked her mother to find out whether she could make colored bubbles in space the mother mixed some red fruit juice with the bubble solution and guess what she got red color soap bubbles you know why because there is no gravity in space and the color pigments did not collect at the bottom of the bubbles so do try this experiment at home and do you also want to know why the soap bubbles burst would you like to know why the soap bubbles burst a bubble is a bit of air which is wrapped in a very thin skin this skin is made up of three layers so there is a soap layer on the outside water in the middle and soap again on the inside and as the water evaporates the bubbles burst so what it is made of it is made of three layers soap on the outside water in the middle and soap again on the inside and then the water evaporates the bubble burst so please go back to your mama papa take your help and do this experiment of making soap bubbles and do try bursting them too and try making different shape bubbles try adding color to them and see if you can make colorful bubbles all right we'll see you again tomorrow with the next story thank you bye bye friends if you like our stories please do not forget to give us a thumbs up and do subscribe to our channel thank you and please don't forget to hit the bell button